every year, there's eight million kids who don't have to die from poverty. Half a century of anti-poverty programs have left more poor people in slavery than in any other time in human history. Experts tell us that there's about 35 million people in slavery today. Moreover, the number of people in our world who are living in extreme poverty, which is defined as living off about a dollar and a quarter a day. So why? Why are so many billions still stuck in such harsh poverty? And Griselda is not the only one. Around the world, poor women and girls between the ages of 15 and 44, they are, when victims of the everyday violence of domestic abuse and sexual violence, those two forms of violence account for more death and disability than malaria, than car accidents, than war combined. We need to rethink the war on poverty. We need a new battle plan. And the primary weapon in a battle plan in the war on poverty is the people in our communities who have the credibility to connect and reach with people. There's a lot of exciting things happening. There are thousands of people fighting poverty, helping people make a difference. We have to find them. We have to learn from them. We have to support them. And sometimes you find that it's right underneath our noses. Just like a little shelter four miles from here.